everybody, my name is Kenzie and this is my mommy. Hi everyone. And we want to show you the special with Fox. Oh, you're already getting right into it? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so I know we just went on two nights ago, but we're coming on again tonight because did you see all those boxes that came yesterday? Yeah, we had a ton of boxes, so we want to show you the so box. a lot of orders came in and included in one of those is our brand. Hi, is our brand new subscription, which is called the Scentsy Whiff Box. So we went ahead and ordered one so that we could go live and show all of you guys what is included in this. So how this works is the Whiff Box, you can sign up on a monthly basis. It costs $30 plus shipping, but there is a way to get it for free, and I can let you guys know that about that later. Um, but basically, uh, Scentsy handpicks what they're going to put in the Whiff Box each month, depending on the season. Um, what's in trend and just what they think that you guys might like to try so it's worth it's cost $30 but you're definitely gonna get more than $30 in product so we haven't opened it yet right no so we wanted to open it in front of everybody for the first time and it, there's a ton of things in here if you just buy one with box just for yourself you have to share with your family because there's might be a lot of goodies in there. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> Katie just was, she said, she's on. She goes, that was a ton of boxes. Remember? It was like stacked up really yeah. high next to our door. Hi, Gigi. <laughs> All right, so here we go. So this is how it comes. Really nicely packaged. Um, let's figure out how we're going to open this thing. And then just like that. Oh, my goodness. Let's show everybody. Gracious. So here's um, how it comes in. There's just a little paper with it. <gasps> Ooh. Oh. Hold on, hold on. I know you're excited. Get Come in and get in the picture with you. So this is just like a cute little thing that comes with it um, that talks about the whiff box. And, oh, Katie goes, hi, Kinsey. Hi. And this month, I guess, is J'adore, which means, do you know what that means in French? No. I love. So maybe this is all the things that you love about Sensi. Mm -hmm. All right, let's get going. All right, so what's the first Go -go thing? Go Mingo. So what is it? Do you it's know what that is? A uh, hand soap? Yep. So this is uh, one of our new... So we, we've had hand soaps. That's not new. Um, but they just released um, some of the body fragrances, the body products in our Go Go Mango. Mm -hmm. You know Daddy likes that one, right? Yeah. So they gave you us a hand soap in the Go Go Mango. <gasps> Blue Grotto? And I know a lot of you guys have tried mm. our bath bombs. I did not smell that before. I know. So with the new catalog release, they released a new bath bomb fragrance called Blue Grotto. Can I keep that bath bomb? We'll see. I'm doing that uh, Blue Grotto was actually a scent of the month last year, and it was so popular that they brought it back as a regular fragrance, and now it keeps going, and now we're getting more and more products in it. And if you guys have not smelled this scent before, it's amazing. And we'll let you see what it is. Show everybody what it looks like. Like. This is what it looks like. It's the color. Maybe, maybe it will change the water. Yeah, it'll and, change it probably blue, right? Yeah, probably because it has blue things. And maybe if you try it, you'll like the smell because I really like the smell of blue gratis. And won't it make the whole bathroom smell like that? Yeah, I hope so. <laughs> and the good thing about our bath bombs, they are hand pressed, um, made here in the United States. And they will not stain your skin or your bathtub. So, I, and, oh, Katie said Blue Grotto smells so good. It really does. And with this bath bomb, what was I, gonna say? I have no clue what you were going to say. <laughs> so, anyways, we got the blue. Oh, I, I know what I was going to say. If you touch this thing, it is wrapper. So, you. You just have to find a good spot to open it. Yes, and then you put it right in the bath. And so then... if you want to, like, touch it like we are, it won't, like, just make a mess on your hands. <laughs> nope, sure won't. And when, how does your skin feel when you take a bath with our It bath feels bombs? so soft and smelly. I yes. hope so. Yeah. I love Kinsey so. Kinsey loves doing the bath bombs. All right, what's next? Oh. Lemon what? All right, so new to Scentsy this catalog season is a bathroom cleaner. So we've had kitchen cleaner um, and some other cleaning products, which I know a lot of people did use kitchen cleaner in their bathrooms, but Scentsy has now come out with an entire line of bathroom cleaner. They sent us a bottle of it in the lemon verbena. Um, I'm 
there is Acne 4. I know, we don't have that one, but um, they did come out with it in the Sea Salt and Avocado, which everybody knows. <gasps> sea Salt and Avocado. That is my favorite scent. So I, I like actually, Lucky and Love. Yeah, Kinsey loves the Lucky and Love. So. And Butterflies and Rainbows. All right, what's next? <gasps> Ooh. What in the... Now, can we see this for the So, last? this is new. They haven't come out with these before. These are basically, like, little testers. They're actually not even that... Um, I mean, they're not even that little, right? That, like, that seems like a lot, right? So, this is one of our new scents called Porch Pumpkin. So, well, literally, you I can just... I that. Yeah, it's one of the brand new ones. You literally just open the little tab up here and put it in one of your full-size warmers, and then you can get a really good idea of how it smells when it's warmed up. Because sometimes it smells different when you just smell it out of the wax, right? Yeah. Sometimes so, when you warm it, it smells way before better. Before you warm it, you can just open it, smell, put it in, smell. Yeah. And if you don't like the smell when you first open it, then just give it away to a friend. Yeah. Or if somebody else likes it, just give it to your friend. All right, let's put that right there. And we got some more of them. Let's open it. Let's see. All right. So this is... Ooh, this isn't even in the catalog. This is called Butter Pecan. So this is a new scent oh, for everybody to try. Good. And then what's this one called? Oh, this is in the catalog. Lavender Cotton, guys. I don't know if you remember, but we had a coconut cotton, which was light on the coconut, but very clean smelling. So this season they did a lavender cotton. So same concept, light on the lavender, but super clean smelling. Love it. Super you guys will like this stuff. All right, what's next? It's called, oh, this one's out. Yeah. Amber Hollow. Amber Hollow. That is actually our scent of the month for this month, September. Yeah, smell it. It smells so good, guys. And they actually put an entire bar of it in this month's book box, so that was nice. All right, what else we got? All right, that's the last thing. What is it? Do you know it's what that is? Red Cadbur. <laughs> this is uh, Red Cedar and Sage, which is another new fragrance um, out Very in the catalog. New. And these are actually our scent circles. I know a lot of people always say, like, what in the heck do you do with a scent circle? Yeah. But, you, oh, can I tell them? What, what can you do with them? You can put them in your car and then probably your... Miss Lindy is watching. Hi, Miss Linda. <laughs> and you just simply just put it in your car and maybe your car will smell good. Who knows? So we do make uh, car bars. Who else is That's Miss Karen. Hi, Karen. Um, we do make car bars, which um, are a little bit more expensive, last a little bit longer. Hi, Karen, again. Um, no, she... that's Tess. Can you say hi to her? Hi, Tess. Um, but these are our scent circles. They can also be used in the car a little bit cheaper, don't last as long, but it'll give you an idea of what it smells like. And there was a different one that's like plastic. Yeah, that's the car bar. Um, another idea that you guys can use your scent circles is if you have um, a way, maybe you have like a little hook or something in your trash can under the liner, you could hang it in there, or you could just simply open it up and put it at the bottom of your trash can and then put the liner in. So that way your trash can is smelling like delicious red cedar and sage and not like trash, right? Yeah. <laughs> All right, so that was cool. Yo, that's it for the night. And well, that was it for the whiff box. So we just yeah, but went... we have two more things to show you, and at the end, we show you something very special, like we did the mm -hmm. other night. We'll turn off so the that was everything then. with the whiff box. If you guys came in late, go ahead and watch the replay so you can see again. Yeah, it replays for a long time. Tess says hello. Hi, Tess. <laughs> she actually came to our open house. Did you know that? Remember when we had the open house? Her and Miss Janet came, and they came and spilled all the yummy Oh, yeah. Sets. Oh, yeah. I forget. <laughs> um, the whiff box, again, is $30, and um, you, it is available here? now for September, and then you can put it in a recurring subscription, or you can just buy it individually um, as you want to. But we never know what's going to be in the whiff box until, you know, it actually comes out. So Mom, I didn't I even know what would... Yeah, we'll put it in the box when we're done. I didn't know what was going to be in this box until we came live and showed you guys. All right. So now we're done with the fifth box. Now we're showing something. All right. In in the new catalog, they came out with a brand new buddy clip. You want to tell everybody what you can do with a buddy clip? Yes. You can put it on your backpack. It, it has a little hooky. I'll let you see what it looks like. And I want to tell you something else. 
if you ever had an owl, the owl one of these, mm -hmm. um, it smells like Udo's over orange, and that's actually in my locker because I'm in first grade. Yeah. So. So Kinsey put it in her locker. So every time she opens it up, it smells like Oodles of Orange, right? Yep. So new for Halloween, they just came out with this cute little guy. His name is, is Vlad the Bat. Vlad so, the Bat. So we haven't opened him yet, so go ahead and show everybody. Can you get it? Oh. In the room. Oh. <laughs> show everybody what he looks like. He looks so cute. All right, so there he is. And show everybody the little clip on the top. So here's the little clip like I was telling you about. So clip it onto anything. Like in my locker, I put my ood my owl on like the thing on my other hook. Yeah. And what is this? This one also smells like? Udo's a orange. It does, which is one of the kids' scents. And if you guys like orange, you'll like Udo's of orange. It is a very strong and orange scent. I know scent. it's kids, but grown-ups can eat it. It kind of reminds me of the orange Tic Tacs. That's what it just smells like. Tic Tac? It's a candy. All right. So that is our newest little guy. He's actually in the Harvest Collection. All of those items are limited edition. So once they're sold out, they're not going to remake them. So if you guys are interested, um, in the video description is my link to my website. And you can always, how can people get in touch with me? Text her. Email her. Facebook friend. <laughs> Call. Call. Come by our house. Come by our house. <laughs> anyway, you guys want to get a hold of me if you want to put this in the next order. And um, if you know her already, just text her. <laughs> uh, all of our buddy clips, they're $15. All right, so we, we've we shown him in a video before, but Kinsey wanted to show everybody what... It, it looks like in the dark she, if you want to have the warmer. She likes to show people what the warmers look like in the dark. So if you want to step out, this is our newest warmer. This is our... For uh, September, I know a lot of people already ordered him, and his name is Rustic Jack. I want to turn on. Oh, it doesn't show very good in the video, actually. His face is all creepy looking. Look, you can't see anything. Ew. Go ahead and turn the lights back on. <laughs> Why is his face so creepy looking? So, he is a uh, tin, he's like a tin can almost, pumpkin. He's got some lines here that make it look rustic, hence the name Rustic Jack. And then his little dish right here is on top, and then that's where yeah. you would put the wax. so can I tell them about the hot the, plate? The number? Yeah, so the number recommended of cubes. Ow. Oh, Re recommended. Thing? Recommended of cubes. You can put four cubes in here if you don't. It just matters about what smell. <laughs> yep. So um, all of our new warmers have the uh, recommended number of cubes for each warmer. Um, this okay. does depend on the space that you're putting it in. Um, big oh. open spaces hold on, require more wax, um, but this one is a four. So. Yeah, so you can put it. So Rustic Jack and Amber Hollow, which is the bar that came in the wood box, those are available for the month of September at 10% off. Um, every time we oh, have... Can I tell them more? Huh? Can I tell them more about that? Okay, one rule. So this, if you if you're new, this if it's a kind of wax, if you spill it, and it will not hurt your dogs if it if your dog is close to it. Yeah, it's one of our safety features, right? Yeah. And if you're new, still you do not scrape your warmers. No. What do we use to clean out the wax? Cotton balls. Yep. The little fluffy things. I'm sure they know what a cotton ball is. All right. So that is the end of our video, right? Mm -hmm. I don't think we have anything else new right now, but I'm sure we'll come on real soon and do another one. So. Bye. I hope everybody has a good night. Bye. Bye.